Buenos dias! <laughs> Welcome to Cozumel! Yeah. So we're excited today because we're going out on an excursion. This is an excursion that's meant for you. Me. It's snorkeling time. And you. Yeah, we haven't really done much snorkeling in Cozumel no. other than at Chonkanob. We mm -hmm. did do one there, but we are going on a catamaran tour yeah. today with Fury Catamarans. I've heard nothing but good things about this, so I'm very excited. This is true, and this is an excursion that you book through the ship. Um, so yeah, we're just going to head out. We're going to get some breakfast first because we need some fuel. Yeah. And then snorkel. Fish mode, who knows what you'll see, but I guess they take you out to a reef and then they take you to a beach. There's some margaritas involved. Mm -hmm. Or beer or soda, yeah. I believe. Yeah. So we'll show all the options and all that stuff, but we're. Um, yeah. And I've seen you can book it pretty much through every cruise line. So oh, it's not just right. specific to MSC in case you're wondering. That's true. And each cruise line might call it something different. I'll put a link, I guess, maybe yeah. to their website down yeah. below. And I think they tell you how to book it Correct. through your cruise ship. Anyway, so they'll have the instructions on their website. But anyway, <laughs> breakfast, we're excited. Well, we're sitting up here at the buffet having breakfast and boom, we look out the window, there's the Fury Catamaran coming to get us. <laughs> Let's see a giant number nine. That must be where we're going since our sticker today says nine. Here is our ride for the day. Ooh, look at that thing. Oh, they got the music kicked up on the catamaran. Fury Catamarans. Welcome everyone to Fury Catamarans. We're going to spend four hours doing this. Sailing, doing snorkeling, and of course we're going to visit our private beach. Where are you going to get included on board this catamaran guys? Of course you will have an open bar included for you guys. We got our Mexican holy water which is the tequila. We already prepared a very good and delicious margaritas for you guys. Those Equis Lager beer as well, guys. You can have for it at the bar. We got soft drinks as well for kids or for people that doesn't like to drink alcohol drinks. También tenemos esta. As well, we got two restrooms that you can be using at any time you need them, located on both sides of the boat. I hope you have a great day. We're going to work for it to make that happen. And bienvenidos una vez más. Muchas gracias. Any question? ¿Alguna pregunta? They're coming around with the air tank to blow up everybody's vest, so you don't use your mouth. They blow it up with an air tank. Just, you know, your mouth. And the snorkels are all brand new, right. so that's really cool. Yeah, that's my own. Yeah, that's my own. Like we reached the first snorkeling spot because we've kind of stopped. Well, first and only, I should say, they do one snorkel stop. They've got these cool stairs that just go down in the water. And we're pretty close to the shore, which is good. It's bright out here. Are you ready to see all the stuff and things? Yeah, I kind of <laughs> like that we're in like a, it's like almost like shore snorkeling because we're so close to land, but that's good because it's for families. True. Stuff, so all ages can snorkel. It's good. All right, they've got the guide out there with the life buoy just in case anybody should need help, but it looks like the pool is open. Woohoo! Gotta check the refreshment level. <laughs> Bye. Go snork all the snorks. We're gonna let D go snork all those snorks. You know me, I do have a prescription mask, but snorkeling, you know, I have to be in the right mood for snorkeling. It's not necessarily my thing, it's D's thing. So, you know, I'm here for those margaritas and the sailing and the beach in a little while where I can spin in circles and act a fool like a moron, like I always do. <laughs> Just stay up here and bask in all this catamaran goodness. They put the sail back down. I missed seeing them pull the sail up and put it down. Ha <laughs> 
We've come down here just a little bit past Puerto Maya. You can see Puerto Maya and the second pier. I always forget the name. I call it International Pier, but I don't know if the one Royal Caribbean uses is that's the correct name or not. But Symphony and Adventure are in today. And we can see them from here, so not too bad. Look at all this water. We could just stink an air snorkel from up here. Good gracious, that's clear. They've got another fairy catamaran right over there, probably with the uh, royal folks up on it. Looks like the other catamaran has gathered up all their folks now. Margarita time. Well, that means last call everybody out of the water, but the bar is about to open. She returns. All right, let's get back down below. at the beach they're gonna try to put the booty of the catamaran up on the sand so we all have to come stand on the front to help the booty get out of the water a little bit well, I guess we're going head first actually I don't know why I thought we were going booty first there we go we're going to spend one hour 30 minutes here at the beach don't get confused because we got another two catamarans next to us so the name of this one is party boat, okay? Party. party. El nombre de este barco es barco fiesta o party boat. Why is included for you guys? First of all, you still having the same open bar back to the restaurant. Same kind of drinks for free for you at the restaurant. Vámonos, thank you so much. And down the stairs we shall go. It is time for water mode here at Fury Beach. They said they've got all of these inflatable water toys which are included. They had things like paddle boards and kayaks and whatnot and floating mats. Ooh, that is, well, it's actually very nice. I would say refreshing, but refreshing is code word for cold. No, it feels good. And I wouldn't call that cold. I would call that fantabulous. Yeah, I don't really see any buoys or anything, I guess. Oh, okay, there might be a little buoy line of white buoys out there. But yeah, a nice little swimming area. It looks like you could go a good distance out here. Yeah. Whoo, that is nice. That is what I am here for is my beach day. You know, I'm Beach Jay having a beach day. It's a couple of little dark spots that look grassy or something up there for Mermaid D to investigate some more. Because you know, you can't ever have too much fish footage. <laughs> Got a lifeguard out there keeping everybody safe. Let's just bask in all this gloriousness. So yeah, all of the catamarans, I guess, sort of grounded themselves on the beach up there. I was originally thinking there was a dock, but now you just plop, plop right into the sand and the water. It's kind of a fun way to enter. Get your feet wet, as it were. <laughs> I can deal with this now. This is my speed. You get margarita. So the, they said the open bar is the same as you had on the ship, which was the, or the boat, I guess I should say, the catamaran, which is margaritas and beers and water. They had Pepsi and 7-Up and Diet Pepsi. That sounds like about it. Oh, Mermaid D's back already. How's your water looking doing? It's clear. It's very clear. Yeah, you can't go too much further past this road, though, I don't think. True. But I just see a few fish, <laughs> so that's cool. And there's a big grassy area. Nice. Nice. They've got burgers and stuff for sale up there, so we may have to check some of that out, because we will be here over lunchtime, and you know I'll get hungry. 
is my first. This is a furious spin. <laughs> Actually, I feel like I should go faster for a fury spin, but then people are like, oh, it's too fast. So this is as fast as I can go and still have a Fury Beach furious spin. Nice. But I think we're gonna jump out, look at some food options, see what the heck they got going on. There was like hammocks, there's stuff we gotta see here. So cute. I know. Let's go. All right. Lead the way to the hamburgers, ma'am. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> All right, so they've got this cute little hammock area. Oh gosh, Dee is already testing out a hammock up here. Well, you just make yourself at home, don't you? Oh, nice. oh, pretty comfortable. <laughs> I love it. It's nice. Well, they just came around with a tray handing out margaritas and beer and all kinds of stuff. So hey, service. Awesome. Wow. Amazing. We got little beach beds back there. Probably first come, first serve. I see restrooms happening. Here's a restaurant. Cheeseburger in paradise. That's exactly what we need. So chips, $3. So you can get either a hamburger or a cheeseburger with a bag of chips for $11. You can listen to Despacito and everything. So we're just gonna sit here and have us a little beach lunch with a view. Woohoo! Oh, somebody's Yeah, they're calling out for one of the Cataburians to go, but not us yet. Oh no, we found some of our friendly coates. That's funny, they're giving them some bread and the little coates are coming up to eat it. Cute! So you have to say chi 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 and they'll come. Or throw bread, that works too. See, it's working. Oh gosh, there's two of them. Now well, let's have a little wander back down the beach. All right, we've come back down to our chairs now. That was a dang solid burger, I gotta uh, say. That was actually really good. Really good. It's time for more refreshment mode now. We've got about 15 or 20 minutes till we probably need to drip a little bit to get back on the catamaran. Gonna make use of every minute. Ah, oh, he is hollering for the party boat up there, and that's our code name. All right, I'm gonna get my, get my dip on real quick, and then we'll get back on the catamaran. Woo, we're gonna get all the spins on we can while we still can. Holy moly, this has been a fun place. <laughs> I can stay here for another day and a half. <sighs> this water's refreshing. Burger delicious. I don't really have anything bad to say. No. <laughs> D is stripping in the water. Woohoo! <laughs> Everything is good here hey, at Fury hey, Beach. Because hey, hey. <laughs> I don't want to wear this back wet. You don't Stop want that. Oh, it feels good. That's nice. That's amazing. <sighs> Today has been really nice. I know. All right, let's start no, motivating out of I here. I know. <laughs> we never want this day to end. We we'll have to come back. That's true. All right. Fine. Yeah, he was definitely saying party boat, so we're gonna go ahead and be good cheerings and get our stuff and wander back that way. It's because there's a lot of us. We're an unruly group. He knows he has to start early and get us on that boat or we're never going to make it because we just love this too much. <laughs> well, now that I'm thoroughly re-wetted, let's get out and get dry. All right, party boat, here we are for you. All aboard. One more peek at Fury Beach. All right, we're ready to head back to the seashore. So on the ride back, I think they're gonna play some tunes. Maybe Dee can get her dance on, even if it's chair dancing. Yeah, maybe. You know. at the port. That's what I call a service. <laughs> right to the ship. That's yeah, amazing. really. This is, you can't get much closer than that. No. Home sweet home. Hola. Hey, Evening. what is up? We are back from the beach and clean. Yeah. We came back to the cabin, did a little bit of work. I slipped, I took a nap. I could not. You know, all <laughs> that sun and margaritas really makes one tired. Ah. <laughs> Anyway, so how was your day with Fury? So good. I realize mm. we've never done something like that in Cosmo That's before. True. And they do have beautiful coral reefs. Um, that was amazing. I got in the water, yeah. Jay stayed on the boat to do I some did. filming, but um, 
so clear so many types of fish it was just really pretty and great for all ages there was babies on that tour there were they had strollers Toddlers, <laughs> like and they were all in the water with their parents and stuff and they make sure they fit you properly for the right kind of gear and true it was good yeah yeah and i mean just service overall like i think at no point <laughs> did i not see them well, after the snorkeling anyway right, they right. were running around the, the boat like trying to give drinks away do you want water do you want right. pepsi you know do you want a margarita and amazing service yeah ooh, for sure so i eventually just had to say no that's my one complaint my one complaint about the whole thing is they have too many margaritas on that boat like todo bien no más yes Gracias. at one point he was like do you want one you want one with a little extra stronger in it and he went behind the thing and dumped some more tequila in there and y'all i did not partake in that one too strong but anyway that was amazing so it thanks was. fury for a fantastic yes. day uh, I would gladly do that again. 100%. Anyway, so yeah, if you're looking for some kind of like easy access, fun family snorkeling, shoot. Yeah. Check it out. Your cruise ship should have it as yes. an excursion for sure. And we'll put the link in the description as yeah, well. Yeah, because like I said before, you can check their website to see what the name of the excursion is. Right. Pricing, I'm sure, is going to vary wildly depending Depends on, on the your cruise, cruise line. line. Yeah. So just look that up <laughs> when you get in your cruise planner manager or mm -hmm. online or something. Yeah. Right. So now it is time for dinner and yes. we are finishing up our trilogy of mm -hmm. specialty restaurants. We have Ocean Key. Yes, I know. No, key, <laughs> K, say it how you want to, but I like to say Ocean Key. It's kind of an Italian seafood restaurant, if you will. Yeah, yeah basically. So we're going to go check that one out. Mm -hmm. It works similarly to Butcher's Cut in that there's like a special page to right. order from if you have the like a dining package, mm -hmm. but we'll get into all that. So it's almost time for our reservation. We better get going. Get so going. anyway, to deck eight. All right. Yes, uh, 6.30. Ooh, uh, cute. Very nautical themed in here. Octopuses and starfish -ish 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 -ish. They've started us off with Norlander bread, French baguettes. We've got a butter and a tapenade. We've also got our pepper grinder and a little fish full of salt. Oh, wow. Cute. <laughs> So let's have a gander at the menu. There is the dining experience page. And again, you get one appetizer, one main course, and one dessert in the dining experience package. You can flip through and see all the other pages of the menu. Oh, I thought it was over. There we go. There's all of your wines and whatnot. And you can upgrade any item on the dining plan to anything else for 50%. Oh, thank you. Or you can actually add items, you know, obviously at face value if you want more than just your three things. But dining experience is normally $60 per person for this restaurant. So D has begun with the crab cake. I went with their marinara mussels. Ooh. <laughs> Apparently I was so excited for the main courses I forgot to actually do video. So here's some photos. D went with the tuna and I got the botarga, which is like, I think it's fettuccine and it has like mullet roe on it. Ooh. Now mullet roe, it's not as scary as it sounds. It just gives it a little bit of a fishy, savory flavor. Kind of like a sardini anchovy thing. Dessert has arrived. Dee has gone with the cheesecake with a berry compote. And I have their tiramisu, which is like parfait style. Good gracious, those were some delicious desserts. That was about two of the best desserts I've had. Ooh, I don't know which one was better. Oh, they got live music in the atrium. show. Oh yeah. Wow. So we're in here from Mystic Forest, which is supposed to be like a Cirque-esque kind of show. It sounds like Celtic women. It does. It's like Irish music okay. in here. <laughs> Tonight we've got a great, a great show for you. I hope you'll join us for country night around the ship. Please put your hands together for Mystic Forest.
Ladies and gentlemen, I remind you once again that our crew staff variety show taking place at one time show at 11 o'clock. You're just in time. And of course, from music and dance around the ship, it's country night. So Boots Coon will be with us tomorrow. Please take a look at your daily program. We have a lot going on, including a session of a Master Chef at Sea. It's a culinary competition like no other on no other cruise line. An opportunity for you to duel it out against your fellow guests and to win possibly some luxurious prizes or possibly nothing. We'll have to wait and see. Why don't we give our entertainers one more big round of applause? Ooh. Welcome to Le Cabaret Rouge. So it is DJ music in here right now, but they will be having the cruise staff variety show here in a hot minute. Coming soon to a stage near you. Well, while we've been sitting here listening to DJ music, it changed from a variety show into a variety moment. So maybe it's a lot shorter now. Ha. Huh. All right, never mind. It changed back to a full-fledged variety show, so we're all good. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for the crew star of variety show. I'll make no this is me. Got our daily program for tomorrow on the bed. Good Ooh, night. Good night. So, gosh, I guess, all right, we got to back it up to at least Ocean Key and talk about all of it our sounds stuff. Sounds like we went to Ocean Key. Yeah, no. See, that was their restaurant. That's we also were, the name of their private island, right. which we're getting to later. Yeah, if we were smarter, <laughs> we would have eaten Ola Tacos tonight after Mexico, Ocean Key after Ocean Key. Eh, no, but it was delicious. Smart. It was a oh dessert. My gosh. And my seared tuna was amazing. Yeah, I mean everything I had. I yeah. actually tried. Yeah, I just I tried things I never had before, and they were delicious. So yeah, but MSC, you guys have got it going on with the specialty specialty desserts, desserts. for sure. They are yeah. so good. Now we've got MDR the next two nights, so we need to check out the MDR mm -hmm. dessert game again, true, true, just true. before we can comment on that again. Yeah. But yeah. Good stuff. Amazing. And then after that, we went to see the show, which mm -hmm. pretty good. Pretty so good. Probably yeah. my second favorite behind Paris. For mm -hmm. sure. Yeah. The strength facts are like yeah. phenomenal. MSC is known for their like, I don't need to call it like extra talent that they bring on. I would say like, like the acrobatic. jugglers. Yeah. yeah. Acrobatics, like Cirque du Soleil style. And uh, they are amazing. Yeah. So probably, yeah, Paris and then mm -hmm. Mystic forest is that what it was called I think so. okay and then whatever the first night was and then the lady silver yeah. one is last right now but anyway uh and then the talent show so good i know so many hidden talents in the uh the crew it's amazing and their dancing skills i love the michael jackson part that was my yes. favorite for sure so good but Good night it's been a overall. Great night, yeah. I know this is the same day we went to Cozumel. This Ooh, is a long day. We went a long day. <laughs> Whew, anyway, we're going to bed now, yes. so we have a sea day tomorrow. Lots of stuff. To Last do sea day, mm -hmm. and then we have Ocean Key after that. Yeah. So anyway, two more days of fun to come. <laughs> no, and we'll see y'all tomorrow. All right. Good night. Thanks for joining, guys. <laughs> Bye.